welcome back everyone, General Tony here, your host, coming back with a brand new COC episode, and welcome my friends to a video which I am so excited to bring you. We have made ourselves a brand new troll base on the channel, inside of the Baby Tony account, guys, check this out. We're gonna call this the Great Wall of Clash of Clans. Now, uh, check it out, look at the size of that, guys. So what we're basically gonna do in a couple of moments time, we're gonna spawn 240 barbarians using my main account on the right hand side there and we want to see if the barbarians are going to make it all the way into the gold vault on the other side of the base so basically the mission is if the barbarians can do it spawn over here near the white flag go through the uh, the great wall there are loads of big bombs in front of it let's see if they can make it all the way guys to where the gold is and take out the inferno towers the heroes and of course finally making their way to the Eagle Artillery. So if you think the Barbarians are gonna be able to do it, if you think they can do it, then go ahead and smash a like on this episode, guys. Let's see if we can get 10,000 likes on the video. We are gonna give a $25 gift card away in the next episode to one lucky person. Now the winner will be the person who comes up with a better name than the Great Wall of Clash of Clans. Let me know down below in that comment section, what would you call this base? One person will win a $25 gift card. I will pick one single comment. So let me know what you would call it down below in that comment section, guys. So we're about to get ourselves into our first live attack. Baby Tony is about to be attacked by General Tony. And of course, we are using this 240 Barbarians. We're also going to bring ourselves the Barbarian King and the King only. Then we're going to use three heal spells, two rage spells to see if the Barbarians can make it into the gold base, guys. And take down that gold storages and hopefully get the Eagle Artillery as well. So do not forget we are doing the 1 million sub giveaway. If you want the chance to win a PlayStation 4 or an Xbox One guys, all you need to do is sub to the channel, leave a like on the video, click the link down below, click enter and you will be entered into the giveaway. So here we go, can you beat my village? Let's see what we can do guys, 240 barbarians against the Great Wall of Clash of Clans. Now this is going to be pretty damn impressive, so 240 barbarians, now we're going to start by just picking off these buildings, guys, because we want to basically execute these buildings. Now, the reason the baby cannon is there is that that's kind of like the scout. That's going to let all the other uh, all the other defenses know that there is a barbarian army approaching on the hill, and we're about to take out this base, guys. So let's see what happens. You know what? We're going to use the uh, the grand warden as well because there are loads of big bombs near that wall there, and we need we need to make sure that the big bombs, you know. Oh no, what have I done? I've just accidentally dropped down the Barbarian. Sorry, the Rage spell. Here we go, though. The Barbarians are making their way into the base, guys. Check this out. This is awesome. This is absolutely awesome. Whoa. So many big bombs are going off. We're going to drop heal spells all along the wall here. Let's see if we can make it through the walls, guys. Check this out. This is so much cooler than I ever thought it would be. But it looks like our Barbarians have already been fried. Now, we are going to do a variety of different attacks, guys. We're going to try a couple of different troops in a couple of seconds as well. But uh, we made it through the wall, so it's definitely possible to make it through the Great Wall. So we're going to try this again. We're going to try it again because that really didn't go too well. So let's send ourselves another challenge and uh, let's hit it again using 240 Barbarians. But this time, we're going to spawn them quicker. We're also going to use the King and the Grand Warden. So check it out, guys. King and Grand Warden are going to go first. And then we're going to uh, drop down quite a few fingers on the screen just to spawn these Barbarians in as quick as we can. There we go. Already half down onto the map. So we do have the Grand Warden this time because his ability is actually going to get my Barbarians through those big bombs. Because the big bombs are going to be a massive problem. Check it out, guys. Barbarians now floating into the base. First Rage Spell has been dropped down. Going to, uh, oh, they're going to miss the Rage Spell. You're going to miss the Rage Spell. Damn. Okay, so here we go. Grand Warden has actually uh, been, you know, just behind the pack there. So much splash damage from the Eagle Artillery. This is where it's going to get interesting. We're going to have to pop the Grand Warden's ability very soon. Here we go. We're going to save it for the Big Bomb. There we go. Grand Warden's ability has just been used, guys. Can we make it through the walls? Cheeky Barbarians, they're going around the walls. The Great Wall of COC is proving to be a little bit less uh, less appropriate than we first thought, guys. Here we go. We're going to pop the King's ability. He's going to rage up the rest of those Barbarians inside of the Great Wall there. And it's actually looking half decent. So we're going to drop down the final two hill spells. And we've actually taken out a lot of the wall. But on the other side there, they actually went around the walls as well. This is pretty damn awesome, guys. We're going to try a variety of different other troops in this episode to see what we can do. So check it out, the Barbarians. Here come the defending Barbarians to protect the actual uh, the gold vault there. And it doesn't look like we're going to be making it through. Now the Grand Warden is about to get taken out. RIP Grand Warden, he's about to die. The Archer Queen's going to exterminate him. There he goes. 
RIP 240 Barbarians. So we're going to try the Barbarians one final time, and then we're going to change the troops up. I've got a feeling they can do it this time. Can they make it all the way into the vault, guys? Let's see what happens. So uh, let me know if you've made it this far into the episode. What troop would you like me to try? We're going to try, you know, a couple of these episodes out over the next couple of weeks, guys. Don't forget the update has been officially announced by Supercell. It will be coming between the 19th and the 23rd of December, the Christmas update. So stay tuned, sub to the channel. I will let you know any information that you guys need to know. So this time, we're actually going to start by dropping in the Barbarians on the corners so that they funnel up and take out the buildings. Then we can do like a direct arrow into the center of the base, cutthroat straight through the center, and hopefully make it into the actual, into the gold vault. So check it out. It's pretty awesome setup there. The four expos, the inferno towers, the big bombs. It looks pretty damn cool. So we're going to cheat a little bit and we're going to drop some barbarians directly onto the cannon there just to check it out. And then the rest of the barbarians going to be dropped down right behind in the center to take out the final few buildings, guys. Here we go. Here we go. And they're pretty much all down onto the map. Barbarian King's going to take the lead. There goes the Grand Warden. They're going to go for the Tesla. Check it out. There goes the Rage Spell, guys. Heal Spell's going to go in just behind. See if we can keep the Barbarians alive. Oh, no. Big bombs are going off. Here we go. Grand Warden's ability has just been used, and they've made it through. Here we go. So many Barbarians have made it through this time. Heal Spells are going to go down, seeing if we can keep these Barbarians alive. There goes the, Barb's King, uh, the Barbarian King's ability. Loads and loads of Barbarians pouring into the base now, and this is looking a lot better. So here we go guys, the Great Wall of COC isn't really holding up too well, there goes a heal spell keeping those Barbarians alive, still Barbarian King and his little footmen are slowly getting taken out by the Eagle Artillery, we got roasted there, we must have lost about 100 Barbarians there, that was pretty damn insane by the Eagle Artillery, but there we go, the big Barbarian King up front guys, he's got his little soldiers just behind him. Going to do some damage. Level 1 Barbarian King thinks he's the man. But my little Barb Army is going to take him down. And wow, he got slaughtered. And we've actually made it all the way into the Gold Bowl. And it looks like we're going to be stealing the gold. So I knew we could do it, guys. Three tries. And we finally made it into the Gold Vault. So we're going to try a different troop this time. Uh, I'm not really sure what we're going to test. So let's just steal the rest of this gold. There it is, guys. All the gold has basically been stolen. And the Great Wall was beaten that was our entry point over there and our barbarians slowly dying so let's just go ahead and end up there so what we're going to do now we're going to send ourselves another challenge baby tony has just challenged me except this time we're going to delete the army and we're going to bring ourselves another troop now i'm going to go with another foot troop guys because i don't really want to go with air air is going to be minions balloons baby dragons dragons but they're just going to fly straight over the great wall so it's going to be kind of pointless if we try a an air attack so we're going to delete the rest of these barbarians almost done so we've got the options to choose i don't know valkyries bowlers we're not going to choose miners because they're going to go right under the wall and so let's just go into the army now so training of the troops you know what we could try wizards wizards could be cool or oh, witches 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 this is going to be awesome let's try witches never really thought of that guys so 20 skeletons oh i've got an awesome idea 20 skeletons and we can actually delete all of the uh, the spells we got, guys. And we can bring 11 skeleton spells. And it can be all the witches. It's basically going to be, hopefully, somewhere in the region. We need to buy ourselves some Dark Elixir, guys. Hopefully, it's going to be somewhere in the region of a 1,000 skeletons on the map. So this could be cool. This could actually be very cool. So there we go. Going to buy ourselves 20,000 Dark Elixir. Go back into the, uh, the training. Hold on a second, guys. We're going to brew ourselves some real cool skeleton spells here so check this out 11 skeleton spells 20 witches this is gonna be awesome let's see what happens so check it out guys we're gonna spawn every single one of them over on the sides actually we're gonna we're gonna spawn the heroes in first they're gonna take out the sides because i want to do a direct arrow into the center hopefully we can pierce the heart of the great wall just to see if we can actually take out the uh the rest of the building so we're gonna drop down the 20 witches just like that should be cool there goes the Grand Warden. We're going to keep the other uh, skeleton spells for now. We don't really want to waste them, actually. You know what? Let's just drop them all down. We're going to do a couple of attacks using the Witches because I want to see what happens. Check it out, guys. So many skeletons spawning on the map. This is absolutely insane. So it looks like the Grand Warden's right in the center. And it looks like we're also doing a little bit of a glitch there, guys. But we're going to uh, we're gonna pop the Grand Warden's ability soon. Wow, it's glitching like hell. Check out the glitchiness. 
Check it out, guys. Way too many skeletons. There goes the Grand Warden's ability. The Queen's ability has just been put. Grand Warden keeping these witches alive. And it's it's so laggy. There are so many troops on the map. Check that out. That is amazing. Just insane. And we've actually finally got the witches and all the troops through the Great Wall, guys. And it looks pretty damn insane. So Barbarian King over on the top there. He looks like he's doing a lot of damage. Here come the defending heroes. 20 Barbarians. Or maybe is, is it 10? I think there's 10 Barbarians inside of the defending clan castle. And it looks like the Great Wall hasn't been able to hold off, guys. But there's still a couple of defenses left. We still have to make our way through the heroes, the Grand Warden. And, of course, reach the Eagle Artillery. But the witches are slowly starting to fade away now. But we still have the heroes. Maybe it was a little bit unfair using the heroes. Was that unfair or was that fair? I'm not really too sure. Here comes the defending Barbarian King, guys. Gonna try and take out my Archer Queen, but it's not gonna happen for him. He goes down. My King has been cheeky and actually dodged the Eagle Artillery and gone straight for the gold. So he's a, he's a greedy little gold digger, my King. There goes the Eagle Artillery. Yeah, the Skeletons just completely ran this over. That was complete abuse by the Skeleton Army. Beautiful. Oh, so beautiful. So we are going to win this episode here, guys. Now, we are going to do another one of these in a couple of hours' time. We're going to attack the Great Wall again, except this time we may change a few things up. We're definitely going to be trying witches, so stay tuned, guys. Don't forget to let me know down below in that comment section, what would you call the base? I will choose one random person who has the best name for the base and give you a $25 gift card in the next Great Wall episode. Stay tuned for that. Leave a like, subscribe to the channel, guys. I will see you shortly. Thank you for the constant support. Peace out.